Hey everybody, it's Kevin here from Bruno Co-Auctioneers and join us on Monday, June 19th. It's 5 o'clock. It's our fine and decorative arts auction. And we have some amazing lots in that sale. There's over 400 lots in the sale. And some of my favorites are, I have five of them here, is of course lot number one. It's a 2007 Harley Davidson Road King and it's a beautiful bike. I took it out of the estate myself. I've uh, pampered that bike for the last month or two. I've cleaned it all up. She's a beautiful bike. I'd sell it to my best friend. It's a really nice bike. 47,000 miles was kept inside the house. So pay attention to lot number one. Um, that's a beautiful motorcycle. And uh, lot number three, a fantastic 18 karat gold uh, presidential oyster quartz. It's a beautiful Rolex. It's uh, in great condition. It comes with all the box and all the papers. It's really nice to get them that way. It, it comes directly from a family that's owned it since new and uh, we're excited to offer that. That's one of those watches you don't see too often, and when they do sell, they can get quite pricey. So it's got a very modest uh, estimate of ten to fifteen thousand. But we wouldn't be surprised if, even in these markets today, with watches as they've cooled down since COVID, that that watch brings up over twenty thousand. And lot number sixty-three is a very large painting. The painting is after Anthony Van Dyke, and it's of the Holy Family. It's a beautiful large painting. It's about four feet by four feet. It comes out of a New York estate. And uh, it's an excellent, beautiful old master painting. It's in really nice condition. Um, it shows very, very well. And uh, it's an interesting piece. We're, we're interested to see how a nice old master painting of that size will perform. Uh, and being after Anthony Van Dyke in uh, today's market. So interesting piece, lot number 63. Lot number 134, very nice painting. Uh, Paul Rizika bombed this painting. It's a very simple painting. It's of the seashore house right there out in the water with just a wisp of a brush showing the sailboat out on the horizon there. Fantastic painting. That's one you're going to want to keep an eye out for. I think it's uh, very moderately estimated at six to 9,000. Works by Rizika have seen a rise over the last few years and also paintings of this style with that very simple kind of blocky sort of subject matter seem to be the ones people are really looking for. And finally, the fifth lot that we have a lot of interest in, I'm sure, is lot number 270 is the Louise Nevelson. It's a sculpture that we've offered before, but as buyer's life change and things change, some things come back to the gallery. It's a beautiful sculpture. You'll really enjoy that one. It's, uh, it's an assemblage of many pieces of found wood, and that's what Louise did. Very simple uh, monochrome painted black, and uh, that's what we have here. It's five beautiful highlights in the upcoming sale, so please join us on the 19th. It's at 5 p.m., over 400 lots, Monday night, a fine and decorative arts auction here at Bruno & Co. And check it out on our, uh, on our website at bidlive.brunoandco.com and you can register and uh, have fun and enjoy the auction. That's B-R-U-N-E-A-U.